Hi guys, welcome to my channel once again. Uh, as you all know, in my last video, uh, I have updated. Actually, I have discussed about uh, an issue of the update description that Me TV, uh, no, the Me Team has provided to this particular model of Me TV 40 inch. Uh, there was some issue with the description, uh, with the description of the update, uh, like. Uh, uh, the, like I was confused like uh, the features that were mentioned in that particular update were already there in this new Mi TV 40 inch variant so I was very skeptical like uh, whether I should uh, go on with the update or uh, you know what shall I do with it so later I know I did my research and I, what I found is uh, like uh, the update actually fixed uh, an issue with Amazon Prime video because there are some uh, there are some users uh, even myself uh, I was experiencing uh, like when I was playing Amazon Prime it was just you know uh, hanging and the app was restarting multiple times so that after that update uh, that issue is fixed and the whole of the TV is now working absolutely fine um, so thank you guys uh, for watching that particular video and um, I have already 500 plus views on uh, in it so I'm really happy uh, that I have you know my uh, partic that particular video is uh, is coming out to be uh, is helping people so anyway uh, i have there are a few a few friends out there who have um, asked me like uh, they want to know about the quality of the audio of this particular tv and uh, about the videos and all so in this particular video stay tuned i'll be discussing about the whole like how is the audio quality of the tv unit that that the, about the speaker that is already installed in this tv unit and um, about the uh, about all the features uh, i'll be discussing stay tuned so at first so uh, at first uh, I'll be playing a few uh, music uh, tracks uh, on YouTube uh, like uh, the most popular one uh, Alan Walker Fade uh, so the, the all of all the you know, music that will be played will be from the TV unit speaker so here is it you can see the volume level is on 15 I'm sitting just in front of uh, the screen of the TV let me increase the volume The TV goes on uh, to hit 50 mark of volume. This is 30. My room is uh, like a single bedroom, and uh, the whole of the room is echoing. It's quite loud, I can say. Even that, if the sound quality is right, the the room for the room is enough. This TV. Sorry guys, I cannot up the volume more because it is already, you know, it's already enough for me. So guys, uh, this was the sound quality uh, from the TV unit. Uh, so in the in the next part, I mean, uh, I'll I'll be going to pause this video here, and then I'll be you know attaching the Mi soundbar uh, that I already have uh, with this TV, and uh, from then on you will be listening the same soundtrack with the uh, Mi soundbar, and uh, you will get to know like how um, this TV performs with the soundbar. So guys, I've already, um, you know, this time I have attached the Mi soundbar uh, with the TV unit. Uh, so now the sound will be coming out from the soundbar. So enjoy the sound. So here it is, like uh, this was the sound from the Mi soundbar. So I'm um, exiting the ex exiting it. So can you be with me? Let me select some other track.
so that's it guys uh, about the sound quality i hope that you have uh, you know you have uh, by now you have some rough idea like uh, how the tv sounds and how the tv sounds with the sound bar of course uh, there is a drastic uh, difference uh, when our tv sound bar is connected with this particular tv so i would recommend that uh, that the speaker with this uh, particular tv is fine is nice is adequate but of course if you uh, want uh, a cinematic experience then of course you need to plug in uh, a sound bar uh, this day sound bars comes uh, in a very cheap price tag like with uh, 4000 or 4500 um, so that's a very good option so now i'll be uh, playing some 4k contents uh, so what i have found is that uh, this particular tv can play uh, 4k contents uh, but yes this tv can play 4k contents but not you, you won't get that particular quality of 4k bear with me my uh, internet connection is not that good like uh, it can stream 4k contents with like uh, smoothly but um, you can see here it's 1440p uh, when i ship this particular to uh, 4k you can see here uh, it's now uh, the blue tick is on 21604k so here it is um, so this is 4k the picture quality is just amazing guys like uh, i think that if you buy the 4k uh, 4k model of this particular uh, you know me tv like the newly launched uh, the what will happen is uh, you won't get a lot of 4k contents available right now so um, what i feel is that uh, if you buy this particular model given that you do, you have like you can bear with uh, 40 inch uh, the for, the 4k model comes with the 43 inch um, uh, size so there's a 3 inch difference uh, so what i'll do sorry guys my uh, no my internet connection uh, isn't smooth with the 4k content so right now the the content is playing in 1440 you can see the it is amazing uh, in naked eyes it's it's just amazing because you know i'm taking the picture uh, from a camera so what is happening is that uh, the quality is of course it will deteriorate so i hope that uh, you trust my words the picture quality is just amazing and one more thing that i have observed uh, like the blacks are really black like when the uh, suppose uh, in the starting of any movie or any uh, you know tv ser series uh, you see that when the name comes uh, in black like the background is black and the name pops up in the especially in the credit or uh, credit scenes uh, the, it it appears like the screen is all black and just just the writing sort of on on the screen so i think um, me has me me team has done a really good job with the screen uh, with the display unit that they have used in this particular TV. Uh, I tried to know with the Mi team like uh, which particular display uh, you know panel they have used, but they said that uh, they can't disclose it, uh, and uh, that's that's the thing that's the information that they have provided me. So as you can see, the picture quality is really nice. Uh, you won't be disappointed, and uh, I don't think that uh, if you are okay with 1080p and uh, you can also play 1440p, and of course you can play 4K if you have a good uh, good internet connection, stable internet connection. But uh, it, this TV can play 4K contents, uh, but the thing is that the quality of 4K content will not be as good as a 4K TV panel. So I think I am able to say what I want to say. So that's it about the sound about the sound and the video video quality. So. In the next video, I'll be uh, discussing about uh, the Prime Video and Hotstar, like uh, how the TV handles Prime Video and Hotstar. So, if you want uh, to know about it, kindly comment um, comment on this video, like uh, you want to know about this. And if you have, if you, have, if you are you know uh, facing any issue about this particular TV, uh, let me know. Uh, I try to reply everything. Uh, I'm not a professional blogger or professional you know um, uh, YouTuber, so I just uh, I'm just putting this video so that uh, someone out there gets a little help about this particular uh, TV model. Thank you for uh, watching this video. Uh, I hope uh, you will find something useful here. Thank you.